danger of ignoring spellings is that you have a massive impact on your PT scores, especially the writing and the listening scores. Most people don't realize the severe impact of spellings in PT until it's too late. Are you unknowingly harming your PT scores by making spelling mistakes? Stay tuned and find out the most important 40 spellings for your PT exam for a 79 plus score. These are the spellings that we have seen as the most repeated words in the PT exam throughout the years. And also how to guess the best spelling if it is not known to you. Hey everyone, I am Anurag, your PT expert and I have seen in my 10 years of teaching PTE that the spelling mistakes can be silent killers for many students. Many people who put a lot of effort in their overall preparation but they make silly spelling mistakes in the end, thereby losing crucial points and completely messing up their writing and their listening scores as well. So in this video, I thought to address this issue and I'm going to cover 40 most repeated words in the PT exam, perfecting them and also spelling technique that can take you to a 79 plus score, especially those like us for whom English is not a native language. Don't forget to test your spellings by typing them in the comments box. Ask yourself, if you are aiming for a 79 plus score, you should be getting 35 or more correct out of 40. And if you are not that ambitious and just aiming for a 65 plus score, you still need around 29 plus correct answers out of 40. In the end, I'm also going to share a technique of making the most educated guess in case if you really don't know the words. And one more thing before we begin, if you really are struggling, please join us for paid PT classes and we will give you many more words than this to prepare you completely. So let's begin with the first 10 most repeated words in ascending order. Abolish. Abolish. Accelerate. Accelerate. Accommodation. Accommodation. Accumulate. Accumulate. Ambiguity. Ambiguous. Ambiguity. Ambiguous. Anonymous. 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 Brilliance. Brilliance. Budget. Budget. As in economy. Budget. Circumstance. Circumstance. The last one is coincidence. Coincidence. First spelling was abolish. Ab o lish. The vowel sound is short or long. In this case, o is the short o sound. Second word is accelerate. Accelerate. Sound of e in English is e or e. In this case, it's e. Next is accommodation. A double c and a double m in the word. Please memorize. Accumulate. Again, double c in this one. Ambiguity and ambiguous. Ambiguity or OUS. Brilliance. Again with a double L in this. Budget is simple where D is almost silent. Circumstance. Sir we know from circle how it's spelled. Come is not C-O-M-E but C-U-M. Coincidence. Here C is C-I not S-I. And dense is again not ending with S-E but C-E. So how many spellings did you get right? Tricky, but you need to learn them as you often see these words in the exam as most repeated words. Okay, now the next set of most repeated words in the PT exam. Ready? First one is contemporary. 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 Continuous. Continuous. The third one is coordinate. Coordinate. Correlation. 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 Dilemma. 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 Discrepancy. Discrepancy. Economy. 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 Ecosystem. Ecosystem. Emphasize. 
emphasize equilibrium the last one equilibrium equilibrium the first one is contemporary break them into syllables and it should be simple enough for you the next one is continuous continuous coordinate is the next word the next one is correlation mind it there is a double r in this word dilemma dilemma again a double m in this spelling discrepancy break the word and get the correct spelling economy should be simple enough for everyone ecosystem another simple word to guess emphasize if you put s or a z in this word both are correct just spelled differently in american and british english and the last word is equilibrium so what is your spelling score this time is it improving are you getting the track time for the third set of most repeated spellings in the pt exam let's begin first one is equivalent 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 extremity 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 poor man poor man poor man frontier 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 grateful grateful indigenous in d genus indigenous the next one is persuade pursuit and pursue similar words but different spellings persuade pursuit pursue and repeat it again persuade pursuit pursue phenomena 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 photography 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 and the last one is pivotal p v t l pivotal first one is equivalent similar to equilibrium that we did in the beginning extremity should be simple enough for you isn't it poor man should be spelled as f o r e not f o u r next one is frontier a mix of front and tier grateful now many people make errors in this word write it as great g r e a t but it's actually g r a t e next word is indigenous not indigenous so try to get the spelling correct another tricky spelling is persuade pursuit and pursue the sound of per is same but spelled differently funny language isn't it p e r in persuade and p u r in pursue and pursuit next word is phenomena slightly tricky but simple if you break it down into syllables next one is photography photography pronounced as photography not photography and pivotal is the next spelling p v t l so there you go we have completed three sets of words now it's time to move to the last batch of words and the last set of most repeated spelling words in the pt exam let's begin first one is prosper 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 recession 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 like the economical recession the next one is saturate 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 scenario see na rio scenario subsequent 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 successive 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 tangible 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 voluntary 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 vulnerable 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 
and the last one is wreckage 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 the first word is prosper next one is recession with a double s saturate notice the sound of chu is not chu but tu c na rio not that difficult word the next one is subsequent again not that difficult spelling successive a double c and a double s in this spelling tangible bl is in the end not b a l next word is voluntary a commonly used word the other one is vulnerable again b l e in the end not b a l and the last word is wreckage wreckage meaning destroyed wonderful all 40 words completed now how many spellings did you get right match it with the criteria that i gave you earlier and practice these spelling words more if you did not get what you need now coming to the crucial part where even if you don't know the exact spelling of the words you can still break the word down into syllables and then try to guess the correct spelling let's say you don't know the spelling of a word complimentary how can you guess it simple we use the knowledge of words you already know complimentary if you know how to spell complete we can borrow complete from it again we already know the spelling of men and then there are hundreds of words in english ending with ery like documentary dictionary visionary so we can use that knowledge to guess the last part of the word which is tary t a r y and there you go we got the correct spelling these are some of the very important spellings that we see getting repeated in the pt exam and that you should definitely be aware of if you want to perfect your spelling further and also want to learn how to guess the spellings of unknown words totally unknown to you then please watch the video 10 pt spelling mistakes avoid these the link for it i have provided in the description i will soon be back with another great video on the pt till then keep watching edutrainx as this is the way you crack the pt exam